foreign volunteer working in the fields of Kibbutz Enashloshani, the Gaza Strip, was killed by a Palestinian sniper Tuesday. The attack occurred shortly after at least 10 Palestinians were killed, including the son of Hamas leader Mahmoud Azahar. This is one of the reasons of Bush visit. He encouraged the Israelis to kill the Palestinian people, and we are going to, to, to defend ourselves by all means. IDF soldiers, backed by tanks and helicopters, are operating in the Gaza City neighborhoods of Sejaya and Zaytun in northern Gaza, engaging in gun battles with armed Palestinians. <laughs> The army confirmed that IDF forces are operating on the ground and in the air against the terror infrastructure. A group of armed Palestinians were hit as they were spotted approaching soldiers on the ground and shortly after a Qassam rocket crew were targeted from the air. Palestinians claimed the majority of those killed by the army were armed and that over 40 had been wounded. In an effort to combat ongoing Qassam rocket attacks at southern Israel, the army frequently launches operations in Gaza in an attempt to curb the terror. On Monday, Prime Minister Olmert declared he opposed a large-scale operation in Gaza, fearing that Israel would be forced to pay a heavy price. Yuval Diskin, head of the Shin Bet, told the Knesset this week that over $100 million were smuggled into Gaza to Hamas by pilgrims returning from the Hajj in Mecca last month. He noted that the funds are used by Hamas to improve the terror infrastructure. <laughs>